Okay, modified Korg Poly 61. I got it off Craigslist for about 25 bucks. It had issues. I had to change out the PCB from this guy to a Korg DW6000 that I had. I also had to fix the joystick with that Korg DW6000. There's a lot of analog in this keyboard, and so I took over a lot of that from the microprocessor. Basically, I took over the waveform selection and the pulse width modulation and pulse width control from the, from the microprocessor for DCO1. I changed DCO2 to something like an additive uh, pulse wave. Um, I took over control of the VCF, adding cutoff resonance, keyboard tracking, took over the envelope generator completely, uh, switched in the envelope generator to the VCA, um, pulled the square wave out of the LFO and made those controls analog. I also updated the, the modulation section. There's a second LFO here. And what I did is the LFO typically applies this LFO to either the VCF or the DCO. I wanted to make cutoff controllable. I also wanted to make it so when I just have it running open or on hold, basically I can add the LFO in here for the DCO or VCF. How does it sound? Well, we can listen to it. It's in hold mode right now. And so I can just sort of You can also adjust the, the arpeggiator.
And that's it, that's the modified Korg Poly 61.